Darth Vader had successfully destroyed not only the cultists, but their entire city and temple, all while the Ninth Assassin awaited the Dark Lord. The energy from the temple ignited molten earth from beneath the planet's surface. Volcanoes erupted as the Assassin closed in on the Sith Lord, who was throwing trees at monsters. Darth Vader now knew that he was being hunted. He had been found and needed to abort the mission. Now the Assassin was being hunted. Vader had finished his business and was ready to unwind with murder. Vader noted that the Assassin was quick. The Empire could use a cutthroat like him, but the Assassin already had a job, so he had to decline. Vader was legit impressed, but the assassin worked for those with more coin than backbone, seeking revenge for those too unfit to deserve it. The assassin saw himself as a last resort for justice, but Vader saw himself as justice. Using the assassin's flight logs, he hunted down his contacts. All of his investigations led him to the Mining Baron, who had sent the Ninth Assassin after Vader in the first place, missing eyes and all, throwing the head of the Ninth Assassin in his lap, pressing his lightsaber to his chest, and ending the Baron's life. Palpatine saw who Vader was now, a loyal dog who was his until he was done with him.